What will you have after 500 years? Oh, you, God. I still have you. <laughs> Hey there, Invincible fans. Get ready to rewind, fast forward, and dive headfirst into the electrifying world of Invincible season one. I'm your host, Cheyenne the Geek, and today we're taking a wild ride down memory lane through the first and last words of our favorite characters from season one. That's right, folks. It's time for our first and last lines. Before we continue this video, be sure to like it and subscribe to this channel for more Invincible goodness. Now, without further ado, first and last lines, Invincible season one. Mom, what? I'll be out in a minute. I don't have a minute. Mom! My bathroom's out of soap. Get over yourself. I used to change your diapers, kid. There's nothing going on down there I haven't seen before. Just get out! Finish high school, I guess. you make me do this? You're fighting so you can watch everyone around you die. Think, Mark. You'll outlast every fragile, insignificant being on this planet. You'll live to see this world crumble to dust and blow away. Everyone and everything you know will be gone. What will you have after 500 years? <gasps> Good. Sounds good. I don't know who you are, but it's time to go. You know about Mark and Omni-Man now, so you might as well know about me. I met Mark in costume before I realized we went to the same school. I'm, um, well, I'm Adam Eve. What? Oh my god, I see it now. You can make doubles of yourself. No, that's duplicate. I'm the pink one. I don't have a minute. Mom. My bathroom's out of soap. Get over yourself. I used to change your diapers, kid. There's nothing going on down there I haven't seen. I spent so much time thinking about if Nolan had killed the Guardians and why he would have done it. I, I didn't think about what would happen afterwards, where it would leave me and Mark. After everything Nolan said and did, I still can't believe it. I can't believe our time together was a lie. I wish he'd come back. Me too. Pour me one of those. I've only got the one glass. I don't care. Poor. Who did this? We have no idea. Not yet, anyway. But we'll find out. And when we do, they're gonna look a hell of a lot worse than your dad right over there. Cecil Stedman, director of the GDA. We fixed the house. Talked to your school and Debbie's work. There's even a headstone in the cemetery. Not that you'd want to visit it. If either of you need anything else, you know how to reach me. Thanks, Cecil. Well, you are big and strong, aren't you? You know it. And you think that makes it okay for you to harass me? Don't walk away from me. What, are you a lesbian or something? Yeah. Oh my god, I wish. Would you leave me alone then? Oh, right. Of course. Mauler twins attacked the White House. Nuts, right? I saw. I can't believe the Guardians of the Globe let them get that close to killing the president. They didn't even get into the building. And Omni-Man was there too. You're such an Omni-maniac. Way to root for the underdog. Big fan of the Yankees, are you? What? 
Oh my god, I see it now. You can make doubles of yourself. Whoa, what a flashback, right? Interesting to see how moods have changed since each character was first introduced. That's all we have for this video. What are some of your favorite moments from season one? I hope you enjoyed this video. Leave a comment below letting me know if you wanna see another first and last lines done for season two. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to this channel for more Invincible content. Mm -hmm.